Hello everyone and welcome back to Youthful Medicine. I am Dr. Tahir. Today I'm going to tell you that Zebmount is primarily approved for chronic weight management but it's under investigation for several additional benefits beyond weight loss. Ongoing clinical trials suggest, suggest that there are potential advantages of this medication. We already know that it is approved for type 2 diabetes risk. Uh, reduction. A three-year clinical trial indicated that terzepatide significantly lowers the progression from pre-diabetes to type 2 diabetes with a reported 94% risk reduction. This suggests its potential role in diabetes prevention among individuals with obesity or people who are overweight or have family history of diabetes. Improvement in obstructive sleep apnea. Late stage trials have demonstrated that terzepatide can substantially reduce the severity of obstructive sleep apnea. Participants experience up to 63% decrease in the irregular breathing episodes during sleep, likely due to weight loss and reduced airway obstruction. Number three, cardiovascular health enhancement. Research indicates that GLP-1 receptor agonists, including terzepatide, may lower the risk of heart disease by reducing the inflammation and improving cardiovascular health even before weight loss occurs. Number four, potential benefits in addictive addiction and cognitive health. Studies are exploring terzepatide's effects on reducing cravings associated with addictions such as alcohol and opioids by modulating brain reward pathways. Additionally, there is interest in its potential to slow the cognitive decline, including conditions like Alzheimer's disease through more research is needed in these areas. These findings suggest that terzepatide's benefits may extend beyond weight management, offering therapeutic potentials in various health domains. However, further research is essential to fully understand and confirm these side effects. But I have to share that in my clinical practice, I've seen many patients showing improvement in many aspects of their health, including emotional health. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel.